the cheer skanks, you ladies have some visitors from the cheer girls and the molly gang, and they are not too happy about the trouble all 15 of you have done. Um, I can't explain ladies. It's not what you girls think. You see, we all did all of the actions it's because that we're there to teach people a lesson about not treating us cheer skanks like shit all the fucking time. Ladies, please forgive us. It was just an accident. Accident, huh? Well that's bullshit. Penelope and the badass cheer skanks. It looks like your damn fucking asses have landed all 15 of you behind bars for life. All 15 of you have seriously permanently lost it. Murder, sexual assault, assault and battery, and even pedophilia. All 15 of you are just fucking sick in the damn heads. I mean, just fucking sick in the damn heads and I'm not going to lie. We cheer girls and the Molly gang did not even ask for psychopathic girls like all 15 of you. This is exactly why the people and the victims brought up your past. And all 15 of you continued to do all these shit for no damn reason at all like a Mary Sue and Karen 24-7. I agree with Penelope. You fucking bastards took the advantage of making the badass gang have sex with all 15 of you every time all 15 of you succeed. And what's even worse, some people saw a lot of your asses doing it. All 15 of you could have end up on a sex offender registry. Yeah. All 15 of you literally betrayed us cheer girls and the Molly gang for no damn reason at all is that all 15 of you wanted to become an attention seeker and that all 15 of you are acting up like Lily Anderson and the worst girl Melody Luna in town. We're glad that your parents permanently disowned all 15 of you forever. Exactly. Our families told us that they all wanted to forget that all 15 of you girls killed your baby siblings just because they got all the attention while all 15 of you did not get the damn attention, and look what has happened to some of the Molly gang members. All 15 of you made Molly Peterson and Yuna Akameen cry huge time for what all 15 of you did a few months ago because all 15 of you had just attacked and killed your baby brothers and baby sisters. How could all 15 of you do to our family like that? Our hearts are completely shattered. Thanks a lot Cheer Skanks for what all 15 of you did to our families. Unbelievable. All 15 of you are just piles of bullshit, I mean, look what all 15 of you did to our baby brothers and baby sisters. You bastards broke our Cheer Girls and the Molly Gang's hearts, as well as our hearts too. I just feel like my heart is broken because of the 15 of you. Wow, just wow. All 15 of you are a big disgrace to the whole society for what all 15 of you have done. All 15 of you are cowards, permanently. We couldn't handle our emotions for what all 15 of you did to our baby siblings a few months ago. And our family will never be the same without all 15 of you. Damn right. Our family will never be the same anymore because of the 15 of you, and now this breaks our hearts forever. We're very crossed with all 15 of you permanently. We are nothing but laughing stocks right now. Thanks a lot for what all 15 of you have done to our family cheer skanks. We all hope that all 15 of you are happy big time. First all 15 of you act like jackasses and jilted wives along with your boyfriends and cheating husbands, and now all 15 of you went as far as to become the new members of the trip gang, and to become just like the dreadful terrorism gang also known as the Doris gang. Unbelievable. Exactly. Not to mention that all of you started the whole group where all 15 of you dressed up like prostitutes, and then took advantage of the men for your sexual and sake acts. All 15 of you girls are straight up bastards for the way the 15 of you treat men like that. That is the last fucking straws. We cannot handle with all 15 of you anymore. All 15 of you skanks are just too fucking much for all of us cheer girls and the Molly gang to handle anymore. All 15 of you do is care about yourselves. All 15 of you are just annoying as that piece of damn shit Doris from the dreadful terrorism gang. All 15 of you said inappropriate shit to all of us back and all 15 of you didn't even say that all 15 of you are sorry. Plus, you called our families dick suckers and all 15 of you are hypocrites because all 15 of you do the same exact shit. And we're all glad that the badass gang were all attacked and killed by the 13th planet crew. 
but as for Donovan and Axel, they left the game for good, and they started cutting ties with all 15 of you permanently. Donovan and Axel despise all 15 of you bastards. And this is what all 15 of you get for committing crimes, being menaces to the whole society and making them do whatever all 15 of you skanks ask them to do. Just fucking deal with it for crying out loud. All 15 of you are better off being single at all costs for the way all 15 of you treat so many people like shit. And here's an idea for what all 15 of you bastards and bitches could have all done. Deal with all the hatred like a fucking mature person and take some fucking responsibilities and accountability for your actions, but no. Your stupid damn asses just had to do the things the hard way. Better way, the intense level, the hard way. You know what, that is the last straw. We are so done with all 15 of you bastards forever for what all 15 of you did. All 15 of you are cowards to the whole society. And so with all that under the way, we all are cutting ties with all 15 of you cheer skanks for the rest of your lives. We cheer girls and the Molly gang have already put the restraining orders on all 15 of you so that all 15 of you will not do any more harm for the good and the better. Good riddance forever scumbags. We all hope this will be the final time that we get to see all 15 of you before all 15 of you meet your ultimate demises. No. Please, don't leave us in jail. We promise that we'll be good skanks from now on. We are so sorry for our actions for what we did. Just shut the hell up all 15 of you. All 15 of you have done a lot of fuckery to us cheer girls in the Molly gang. All 15 of you are just insane bastards and cowards. Melody Angle heard that all 15 of you killed our baby brothers and baby sister just for the hell of it and then all 15 of you went on a crime spree afterwards. Now our families will not be the same without all 15 of you. I feel like my heart is going to shatter permanently. I'm totally stunned and completely heartbroken right now for what the 15 of you did, and I agree with Maria, not going to lie about it. Penelope said that all of you are a huge Mary Sue to the whole society and look what has happened to all of you for what all 15 of you have done. We're getting so sick and tired of all 15 of you doing a lot of ferocious acts like going on our crime spree and getting involved with home invasions and murder. All 15 of you totally hurt our feelings as well as Molly Peterson and Yuna. Shame on the 15 of you, big time. Yeah, all 15 of you are the biggest mistake that could have anyone to have ever asked for, and we cheer girls and the Molly gang are really crossed with the 15 of you, permanently. Our family's lives are over for what the 15 of you did to our beloved baby brothers and baby sisters, and now my sisters Brittany and Gina are crying like babies for what the 15 of you did. Shame on all 15 of you cheer skanks. We all hope that all 15 of you are happy. Wow, just unbelievable. We can't believe all 15 of you cheer skanks have done a lot of fuckery for what all 15 of you have done. I mean, look what you've done to our group and all of the cheer girls. All 15 of you made the cheer girls and our leader and our best friend Ina cry. We're so very cross with all 15 of you girls. That is so it. As of today and beyond, we all have no other choice than to cut ties with all 15 of you bastards. We all hope that all 15 of you are happy for what all 15 of you did. There are no words to describe all 15 of you, but all 15 of you are a big coward and a big psychopath to the whole society. We all hope that all 15 of you got what the 15 of you deserve for the rest of your lives, and if all 15 of you break the restraining order to us or to your parents, your asses are going to be done for and all 15 of you will be beheaded. Good riddance forever scumbags. We all hope that all 15 of you are happy for what all 15 of you did. And we all hope that this is the final time before all 15 of you will be beheaded. No. This isn't right. We promise that we'll be better. We swear to God. I don't want our lives to be in jeopardy anymore. We swear that we'll do better by then. All 15 of you promise to be good and better? That's bullshit. My old and new parents told my older siblings and I all about all 15 of you. Naomi and Jennifer also found out the same as well. I have not seen all 15 of you do horrible stuff to the whole society. I mean... What the heck are your problems? I agree with my bestie Waffles, not going to lie about it. 
Besides, what all fifteen of you did to the whole society and to the whole family of yours was absolutely unacceptable. My siblings, my old and new families and I have not seen all fifteen of you psychopaths do something as sick like this. Thank God your parents have disowned all fifteen of you, otherwise we all are going to be dead for Pete's sake. I'm totally stunned and shocked right now about what Waffles and Emmy and their families have actually told us about your attitudes. We all haven't seen all 15 of you traumatized everybody in this whole society just because all 15 of you have the damn audacity of becoming entitled Karens and Mary Sues, and even killed your baby brothers and baby sisters a few months ago, and look what has happened to both the cheer girls and the Molly gang right now. They all are crying and bawling their hearts out because of what all 15 of you did to them. I feel like that my heart is breaking right now. I 100% agree with everyone including Waffles and Emmy along with their older siblings and their old and new parents, not going to lie about it. Plus, I feel so bad for the cheer girls and the Molly gang and we all are sending them peaceful wishes and condolences about what happened a few months ago. I feel like this is getting to the point of where Melody Amble, my adoptive sister from the cheer girls is going to start crying about what happened. Unbelievable. I didn't even see all 15 of you bastards have done a lot of fuckery to the whole society. Waffles and her best friend Demi told us everything about all 15 of you. My wife and I feel very bad for the cheer girls and the Molly gang about what happened to their baby siblings. Since all 15 of you were disowned by your families, and since all 15 of you lost everything, we all are going to say this for once and for all. We are cutting ties with all 15 of you cheer skanks for the rest of your lives. The cheer girls and the Molly gang have already put the restraining orders on all 15 of you so that all 15 of you will not do any more harm for the good and the better. Good riddance forever scumbags. We all hope this will be the final time that we get to see all 15 of you before all 15 of you meet your ultimate demises. Yeah. Good riddance assholes. Traitors. Guys, don't leave us. We are so sorry about what we did. We promise we will be better by then. Yeah. I guess this is going to be it. We lost everything for good. First we lost our friends, now our first boyfriends, then our parents, and now our second and final boyfriends. Not to mention that the cheer girls and the molly gang have also cut ties with us cheer skanks and now we also lost them forever. I guess we'll have to behead ourselves for good this time. I guess this is also goodbye for life. Agreed. Agreed.